All right, hello everybody and welcome to the channel. As usual, my name is of course Constantine and today in the world of indie games, we're just about to check out a brand new game called Distant Bloom. Now today we're going to be checking out an early uh, build here of the game. Uh, it might have some issues, it might have some things that are not going to be present in the final build of course and the, in the official release of the game. But uh, just keep that in mind as we're going to go through uh, the gameplay here. Uh, but that being said, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this, make sure you leave a like. A uh, quick mention here, I would like to thank the developers of course for providing a review copy share game with you all. And without further ado, let's dive right in and uh, let's check out Distant Bloom together. Let's see what it's all about. Oh, look at the aliens. <laughs> I have a feeling we're going to be playing as one of these aliens from what I know from the trailers. Because as you guys can imagine, uh, whenever I'm actually deciding to uh, play a game and feature it on the channel here, uh, I always kind of like know a little bit of information about it before I uh, bring it over to you guys. And uh, apparently this one is the one that's going to lead to a new location. Look at that. And I have a feeling we're going to be playing Azim. <laughs> oh gosh, what's happening? Oh no, we crash landed. Sleeper, sleeper, wake up. I'm awake, I, I think. Asleep for 547, 500 cycles. Stand up, Awakener. Whoa, what just happened? Yep, so apparently uh, the ship we were in did crash. No, are you kidding me? Pick up. Help. <laughs> hey, there we go, little buddy. Hey there, bud. Don't be scared. Big thank you, Unwrapper on Trapper. What happened? Eh, hey, remember that I incomplete. Are together safe now? Yeah, but my cryopod is completely broken. And uh, what is the health ship? Well, my pod detached from the uh, health ship. Did it separate during landing? Yes, yes, detached, crashed, trapped. <laughs> hmm. Uh, wait, why can I not go back up? Are you okay? We're on diagnostics. Diagnostics. Uh, Untrapper nearby. Key protected. Yeah, I'm here. Don't worry. Can you look at the hearth uh, ship? Uh, triangulation, I saw radius. Hmm. Then we'll have to search for it. The elder and the others might be in danger. Let's get away before this thing goes boom. <laughs> oh, so wait, there was more people with us? Not just me? Yeah, I think it was like a bigger ship, right? And I was not the only one in it. What's this junk doing here? Pod crash. I don't think so. It looks like it's been here for quite a while, but how? This plan is supposed to be untouched. Pick. Ew. Why would I pick up something else's trash? Research? <laughs> um. Let's go with that. Being an assistant is better, but I can hand this one to our actual scientist if they're awakened. Ah, pick it up. There we go. We got a new resource. Awesome. Okay, perfect. Let's check it out. Ooh, we discovered a valley. The cliff path. Interesting. But there's definitely no way I'm going to get there unless I'm going to build kind of like a bridge or something. I wonder if this game is going to also have building. I'm pretty sure it does, right? It's going to have like a farming, building, and all that jazz. Uh, I'm also noticing something all the way up here. Mm, nope, never mind. There's nothing over there. Okay, okay. Let's keep on exploring then. Let us see what else we can discover. Ooh, more trash. Here we go. Garbage added. Oh gosh. Why did the light change all of a sudden? And more trash over here as well. Uh, I'm guessing you're going to be able to maybe drop down there eventually. 
I'm not sure. What about that? This plant was lush with life when I saw it from Alta 2, but none of the plants look like in uh, the guidebook. Hmm. Blurry telescope? Yeah, the images might have been a little fuzzy, but we've been in cryosleep for a very long time. Who knows what happened? Yeah, apparently it has been quite a while since uh, we've last been here, and apparently the plants all look dead. I wonder if I'm going to need to um, bring them back to life somehow. Apparently the, the planet that we were planning to come here for is completely different than we uh, what we were expecting. More trash over here. It's quite a bit of trash. Got more trash on this side. Oh, there's a cryopod. Hold up. Let me try to wake him up. Another cryopod. They got lucky. Whoever's inside is still uh, sound asleep. We should wake him up. Uh, follow safety regulations. Only the mission leader may uh, wake the crew members from uh, cryosleep. Oh, you're right. I really hope that the elder is safe. Otherwise, this altar will be in there for a long time. No more sleep. Is lonely. Don't worry. We'll come back for them. Oh, so that means I cannot wake him up. Are you kidding me? Okay, never mind. I guess I gotta find the right person to be able to uh, wake him up. For now, let's keep on exploring. Collect more trash. I don't even know why I'm collecting all this trash. Heart ship is radi in radius. Ah, I can see it on my compass now. Wait, what? Oh, we do have a compass. There we go. This is your compass. It shows your general direction towards things with the importance of time. Hmm. Okie dokie. It also kind of like shows the day and night cycles as well, which is great. Oh gosh, I cannot cross through there. Seriously? Hey, there's the ship. Awesome. <laughs> Woohoo. I wonder if this is kind of like a survival game with crafting elements and uh, stuff like that. Because I really enjoy these type of games, and uh, if it's going to be like that, then it's going to be a really, really fun uh, adventure. So let me make my way to the ship first. Of course, we cannot explore there either just yet. Let me go down here. <laughs> oh man, but the ship landed really uh, nicely, actually. Hey there, you're awake! Of course I am. A robot could not be in charge of landing the, the uh, heart ship. It is a delicate task, which I executed flawlessly. So you meant to detach the cryopods? Detach? <clears throat> uh, you mean to say uh, the survey probes? No, I mean my pod crashed nearby. I woke up on the ground and found a key trapped by rubble. Oh, um, yeah, by the plentiful. There must be... There must have been a malfunction or something. All the probes were meant to detach before landing. Uh, we will sort this out uh, promptly. But tell me, but tell me, what is it like out there? What did you see? Uh, I found junk. Uh, let's go with us. Uh, I found another altar pod. Hmm. It seems intact, but we should get them out of there quickly. Of course, you did well to follow the protocol and find me. But the pods offer protection. Before opening any others, we must ensure that our surroundings are also safe. Hmm. At the risk of sounding like uh, Osluk, uh, these plants look suspicious. Examine them and report them back to me. Here, take the exoscan. It will show you the data about everything you scan. Hey, we got a new tool. Awesome. Okay. Uh, scanning object will provide you with more information about the object in the question and will be stored in your journal. Okie dokie. So we select it with one. So you select it and then you can go here and scan. There we go. Garbage. Okay. Uh, pick up. So now we can chat with him about it? Did I tell you about that? Uh, never mind. I forgot. <laughs> what? Uh, okay, we gotta go sp uh, scan some plants. Let's see. There we go. A uh, large metal. Huh. We cannot collect it though, unfortunately. That is also scrap metal. What I'm looking for right now is plants. 
Uh, scan plants around the hearth ship. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do, but I cannot find them. Okay, there we go. Found it. Hmm. Environments. Uh, Hedaxipa. Herbs. I already scanned it. Okay, I think now I did it. Uh, all I gotta do now is just go report to the uh, elder. Let's see what he's gonna say about it. This is pretty cool. Uh, I think we can actually play this one with the controller. It might be a little bit more fun. Uh, wait. I already scanned it, dude. What, what are you talking about? Maybe I gotta go scan multiple of them. Mm -hmm. That's why, yeah. Okay, let me scan these ones. Glass waste. What? Okay. So that's been scanned. What else? It doesn't look like we can sprint or anything at the moment. Okay. Yep. Of course, these ones are also dead. Uh, apart from the ship, Wanderer. Yeah, hold up, hold up. I'm going back. I'm going back. Don't worry about it. You know me. I love exploring. So there's going to be more plants on the right side here somewhere. Hmm. That's a dead tree. Pick that up and scan this one. Why can't I? There we go. That was the last one. So we've got a fern, an herb, a tree, and let's show the elder our findings. Okay, buddy. Let me see if I can show the elder the findings. Elder, I think the plants look bad because they're struggling, not because they're uh, dangerous. I was wondering if it crashed. Nah, that cannot be. We had trash everywhere on Alta 2 and never had any issues. Just stop picking it up and uh, you should be fine. Or start picking it up. Either way, if there's no danger, then you might want to go wake up the fellow crewmate. Hmm, are you supposed to open the pods? Well, I have to <clears throat> uh, locate the survey probes. Yes, it requires running complex triangulations from the ship's console. In the meantime, I trust you will handle the pod opening task uh, at utmost care. <laughs> Alright, I'll do my best. Take it. Uh, journal to find your way. Ah, so this is our journal. Well, we can see the map, journal, uh, seat bags, and the inventory. Interesting. Uh, I switched to playing with the controller because it's definitely, definitely much easier to play with the controller. The game has definitely been intended to play with the controller. Can't climb back up. Yeah, I know you can't. This is why we're going to go through this side. Hiking time! <laughs> Ooh. Elder said no more trash picking, but why not? Yeah, one the... Whoa! What do you mean no more trash picking? Because apparently if I pick up the trash, I'm expanding the grass. I'm healing up the planet. Witness, trash picker. Oh, like I thought, it was the trash making them struggle. I had no idea plants could look so pretty. Uh, removing pollutants, heal the soil, and plants. Awesome. That is pretty cool. Okay, now we know what we gotta do. Now we have a mission, I guess. There we go. So we're gonna be able to heal up this part as well. Whoa. Uh, it kind of like opened up a path for us. It's not just that plants that grow when I clean this up. This robot is massive. Do you think that it's sturdy enough to walk on? Hmm. Root bridge. Wait, wait for me! <laughs> I don't know if this is where I was supposed to go. I think I was supposed to actually go the other way uh, to save the plant. Uh, the, uh, the, the, what is it called? The person. The other person. But I decided to go somewhere else. <laughs> That's fine. What is this? Hmm, more junk. But it looks different. Is it organic? It seems to react to nearby plants. I gotta scan it though. How do you... Oh, like that. Scan. Hmm. Uh, solidified goo. Interesting. Hey, look, the plants filter out the pollution once they grow. Ooh, good plants. Ah, so we got rid of that stuff. 
Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Uh, no trees there to expand the greenery, of course. We got some more trash on that side. More trash on that side, but I gotta climb up first. So, uh, let's collect that. I've always really enjoyed these type of games where you're kind of like healing the planet by collecting and removing the trash. I did play quite a bit of these games in the past and I really enjoyed it. I don't know, it's just something about these type of games. There's also a brand new game coming very, very soon that I will definitely feature on this channel, uh, which has kind of like the same thing where you gotta heal up the planet and uh, save the creatures. I cannot wait to play that one as well when it comes out. Uh, oil spill. Hmm. We're probably gonna have to figure out how to uh, get that oil. Ooh, I think I just saw the pond. And this is gonna be the path that I went through uh, in order to get back to the Elder. So let me get this guy saved up here. Hopefully can figure out how to uh, save him. Hey buddy, wake up. Look at him. Wakey wakey. Ah, well, that's a face I wasn't expecting. Uh, did we arrive? Yes, we're on Alta 3 now. Hmm, thank goodness. I don't think my bones could have taken one more day in that pod. Wait, I thought we'd be by the hardship. Yeah, well, we're not far away. Uh, just go through the cave and uh, you reach it. Great, you go on ahead. I need to gather uh, my uh, flavored capsules first. Hmm. Interesting. My back. Yes, it's better now. Thanks. Okay, um, nothing over there that we gotta collect. Wake me up, return to the hearth ship. Yeah, I will, I will. Give me a second. Give me a second. Uh, there is more to collect around here, but uh, we don't really have the ability to do that just yet. All right, in that case, let me go to the hearth ship. Right back through, not here, here actually. I'm quite curious to see what else we're going to be able to unlock in the game. Abilities, structure we're going to be able to build and stuff like that. It's going to be pretty fun. And I kind of like uh, the look of the game as well. It's really interesting. Right, I see the hearth ship. I know, I know. I got to go back to it first. Right through here. Uh, base sweet home. <laughs> it's not home sweet home. It's base sweet home. Ah, uh, good. You returned in one piece. Yep, mission accomplished. Oh, then where's our fellow crewmate? Well, what happened was... <laughs> Oh, what's happening? I think my robot just spotted something. Very well. I suppose they should be arriving any minute now. Uh, good work of both of you. Uh, where did that robot disappear to? Kiki? Hmm. Well, they could have gone too far. Don't worry. I'll go take a look around. Okay. Uh, find Kiki. Hey, buddy. What are you up to? Where are you going? Big Root. There you are, buddy. Why did you just run off like that? Activity detected. Hmm, a bit of a life is coming back into this route. It is because of the planet uh, we helped up earlier. But it seems that it's not quite enough. Uh, not yet, at least. We're led. We're, we're lead? Inside the cave? Hmm, I can't really see it. Uh, we'll get to the root of this issue. If only you were strong enough to carry me over there. Maybe helping more plants might do the trick? Hmm, but that's for later. Uh, let's go and see if uh, Bahan has arrived yet. Yeah, I will try my best to fix up this place as much as possible. Hey, there we go. They're both here. Ah, uh, good. You found the robot. Uh, Bahan here has just arrived moments ago. Ah, uh, there you two are. Thanks again for coming to fetch me. I will have naturally come to wake you up myself, but uh, I cannot leave the hardship in the in the hands of the Greenhorn. No worries, your assistant has been very helpful. Elder, me and Keki managed to bring some light back to the nearby roots. That is, uh, nice. Now, let us unpack. I found a storage tent in the ship. Um, set it up, would ya? Hmm, am I supposed to leave my precious flavor capsules in the tent? Where's Risa? They should build a workshop. Actually, where's everyone? Hmm, well, the tent, assistant. Okay, uh, I'll place it in a nice spot. 
Uh, won't be much of an improvement, but yeah, I, but I appreciate that. As long as I have space for all my sporks. <laughs> uh, tell Bahan when you're done. Uh, there is more to do next. Okay, carry the box from the hearth ship. This box. Oh gosh. So this one is an assembly box. I lift with both your legs <laughs> and place the tent over here. Hey, there we go. Awesome. We got it. Uh, it's a little bit too dark though in the game. All right, anyway, uh, apparently it started raining a little bit. The tent awaits you. Thanks, but uh, I found out that from the elders that there's a spot in the ship's hold. Your spot. I don't think I can fit both myself and all my utensils in this tiny tent. Uh, what do you say about switching? <laughs> you mean I'd go sleep in the tent and you go sleep in the ship? Fine. Thanks. That's very kind of you. I'm gonna carry my stuff to the ship then. I might have uh, overpacked a little. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, what's in here? What in the name of Plentiful is this? What is this shovel doing in my backpack? Did I sleep in the thing um, the entire journey? No wonder my back is killing me. <laughs> Just you wait until you get older and your joints start aching. You won't be laughing then. Go easy. Here, I'll take it all for your hands. Thank you. I don't want to see that thing ever again. I think I just got myself a shovel. Awesome. If I press up, I can activate it. Interesting. Elder. Oh, uh, what now? Uh, are you alright? Naturally. What would I not be? Well, is there anything I can help you with? Uh, the first step in the mission is the guidebook. It's setting up a home base. Albeit, nothing details what to do if the crew uh, scatters. No, the Elder Federation the, thoroughly devised this guidebook. If we just follow the steps, we can get to the bottom of this. Hmm. Finding others is the highest priority. I share your concern, yet it is not that easy. I'm not supposed to tell you this, but I need you to understand the situation. There were some uh, budget cuts on the EXO cut before we launched our expedition. I believe an emergency release system was planned, but then scrapped halfway. So while the eject button still exists in the hot ship, the pods actually cannot be tracked if they detach. Whoa, that's dumb. <laughs> yeah, we're not here to question those who made the expedition possible. EXO code passed all the uh, Federation's safety regulations. Well, then we'll come up with our own solutions. Why do you, uh, well, why do you not focus your energy into something useful instead of uh, pestering me? Oh, just in time. Uh, do you hear that? It is the ship alerting us that the location of one of the survey probes. Go inside the ship and load the coordinates into the compass, then go away. <laughs> to find the probes, of course. They get... What are you hiding from me, buddy? There's something that he knows. Follow the signal southwest. Uh -huh. So of course there is something southwest of here that I gotta figure out, but I cannot go through there. Ooh, hold up a minute. Scan. A bubbling goo. Interesting. But of course I cannot click and I cannot do anything with the shovel with it. Apart from ship wanderer. Wait, what? I mean, I know I'm far from the ship. But I cannot go southwest unless I can just go up here. Whoa, what are these? Oh, is this where I got to use a shovel to dig? It is. Ah, I'm basically making holes and then I'm able to plant something in these holes. Kind of like, uh, in order to get resources, right? But the thing is, I have no seeds available, so I can definitely not plant anything. Right? Yep, we got no seeds, so nothing for us to plant. Never mind. And same here. Look at that. Okay, never mind. Let's keep going. Environments. I mean, I already scanned it. What about this one? A pillocus, and this one is garbage. No, this plant I want to scan right here. There we go. Awesome. We got them all scanned. Pick up the trash. Hey, it's healing up the root. There we go. Root bridge. 
Kiki, hold up. I just noticed there's something growing on this herb. Hmm, see that thing they're called. I'll try grabbing some before we move on. Ah, uh, resources like seeds can be harvested from the plants that have bloomed. Simply walk up to the, uh, such plants and uh, press harvest. There we go. Awesome. Okie dokie. So now that I got those seeds, I'm going to be able to plant them somewhere. But first, let me follow this route. We discovered the rocky shoreline. Wait, can I walk through there? No. Okie dokie. I wish I had a line that I could actually activate. Unfortunately, that is not a thing. Ooh, another pod. That's right, but it's locked into the other side of the cliff. I don't think you can reach it from here. Let's find another bridge. Okay, hold up. Let me pick up the trash here first. There we go. Are these gonna grow and I'm gonna have to wait for them to grow? Or how do I collect the seeds from there? Oh, I can I can actually I cannot cross. I gotta find a way to climb up here. Yeah, that's what I gotta do. But in order to climb, I gotta bring a little bit of a heart to these roots, right? To get them to grow. Okay, let me see. So if I give it up this garbage. Hmm. Seems like only removing the pollution wasn't enough for this spot. You know, I've been wondering. I don't really know how plants work, but there's a way to grow them, right? Ask seed? Hmm. I don't think they can talk. Uh, whisper, can they? Hmm. They grow from the ground, so let's just put it on there, I guess. Okay, so now... If I get the shovel, I dig this, and I plant. Ah, it is connecting. Look at that. And if I plant another one here, there we go. I understand what's happening in the game now. That is pretty cool. Okay, let's do the same thing. Let's plant this. Dig. Uh, plant. And again, plant. There we go. Awesome. Okay, I like this. It kind of has a little bit of a uh, puzzle aspect to it as well that you got to solve. Which is not bad at all. Plant this as well. I'm going to need more though because this is my last seed. So hopefully we can get more. Huh? The plants grew even bigger this time. Herb, fern, tree, grow together. Yeah, maybe they like us. Having a variety of uh, different neighbors makes them happy. Oh, look, all of them have lots of seeds now. Maybe it is safe to grab some more from all of them? Hmm, not that they have grown so big. Interesting. So that is true. If you basically combine uh, the seeds, eventually you're going to get more seeds in return. Okay, let's clean this up. So, what do we got? Something we're flying just now. Hmm, were those seeds? It must have been. Now, plants are growing when they landed. Hmm. Nah, it's good. I think that's how they spread. It will help us uh, plant seeds faster, I guess. Uh, when plants bloom, they will attempt to spread their seeds to nearby empty tiles. Interesting. Here we go. There's nothing in that tree to collect. Nothing here either. And nothing here either. So... What I gotta do, let me dig these all up. And uh, let me figure out what I gotta plant here to get more seeds. So that's a fern. And this one is a herb, right? So we got a fern and an herb. So if I plant, let's see. I don't know, I think it's this one. Yeah, for the tree, right? So we got herb, fern, and tree. So if I have all three of them connecting... Hey, there we go. And he gave me another tree here. And this one also grew. That is awesome. And now here, we can plant a... Herb. There we go. Uh, that is so cool. And of course, this one has grown up. Awesome. Okay, let me see if I can get more seeds. No, collect all of them, dude. Why is he not allowing me to, though? 
This one doesn't have it. This one doesn't have anything for me. And this one doesn't have anything for me. All right, we're good to go for now. Uh, we cannot go down there. Let me take this out. This. And this. Okay. So, this is going to be a herb. This one's going to be a fern. And this one's going to be a tree. There we go. Full connection. And I'm going to be guessing they're also going to give me seeds once they're done growing. Yes, they are. There we go. Awesome. Okay, perfect. So this one allows me to go back down here. And now we can cross to the other side. There we go. These roots are really handy. We gotta grow something to get rid of that. Uh, we'll also have to grow something here. So let's do a dig. 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 And dig. Okay, first of all, let me go with a herb. Uh, other than the herb, we need a fern over here. Now we need... Hey, there we go. Awesome. It did its job. That is so cool. And I get it. I get it on that's uh, what, what is happening. You can basically only have five of each seed. That is why I keep on dropping some of them, right? And I'm only collecting one. I get it now. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Hold up. Let me see if I can make it to the uh, this side first and release this fella. Bring the nose to Elder Umbra. Track quest. Wakey, wakey. Huh? Hmm. How did he just get out of the pods? Unless... No. Did we just forget him on Ultra 2? Uh, Kiki guard pods on ship. Everyone there. Hmm. Well, it's a note from uh, Risa then. Interesting. Hold up. What is she saying? To Elder Omeral. If you're not the Elder, take this to the Elder. Read. Uh... I'm the Elder Assistant, so I'm going to wake up. I'm going to go with it. Woke up from cross sleep three cycles ago. I'm unharmed. I considered the pros and cons of waiting for rescue. Decided to head out. I'll follow the river. Risa. Hmm, weird. Why would Risa not wait for us if they thought that uh, we'd find them? And who knows how long that river is. Let's bring the note back to the Emerald together with the survey probe data. Okay. Before I do that, let me keep on exploring a little bit. Collect more stuff. Uh, I cannot plant anything over there because of the trash. Hmm. Yeah, we cannot get rid of this metal scrap over here, unfortunately. I just gotta find the uh, survey probe first. Which is probably here. There we go. This must be the survey probe the Elder mentioned. It seems to have gathered quite a lot of data about this region. I hope that the uplink still works so we can send it back to the hearth ship. Instructions? Hmm. It shouldn't be too difficult. Just let me see. Ah, there. Okay, let me go back to the Elder then. As this part of the quest is completed for now. And now we're going to go exploring again after this. I'm pretty sure the elder is going to say, uh, go and find the person that we're supposed to find. While uh, he's going to do something else, I guess, back at the base. So let me go back through here. Bring the note to Elder Omeral. Base, sweet, home. <laughs> uh, okay, what is this? I think this one was a fern. Okay, so that's a fern. Which means in here, I gotta plant an herb. And in here, I'm gonna plant a tree. There we go. Awesome. We made the place better. And now we can collect one of those seeds. And then the tree seed. Oh, wait, that was a different one. Hmm. I don't know what that was. 
Uh, in that case, let me also plant stuff over here. Oh, never mind. Uh, in that case, let me plant. Oh, look at that. We have two uh, types of ferns. Interesting. Let's go with the tree in the middle. In here, I'm going to place an herb. In here, I'm going to place a fern. And here, I'm going to place one of these ferns. There we go. Hey, that was perfect. Oh, we fixed up the entire place now. What? That is so cool. I love it that it does that. It is so, so cool. Okay. Unfortunately, we did not manage to get new stuff. But I got more er, uh, more fern there. Perfect. And not only that, we're bringing back to life and we're seeing all the greenery being back to life, but we're also kind of like starting to hear the nature. Elder, I found Reese's spot down by the uh, shoreline. It was empty, but they left a note. Why did you just not start with that? Mm, nearly gave me a heart attack. Give it here. It is addressed to me, but I can see that it has been opened. Not by any nosy assistant, I hope. <laughs> mm, let us see. Risa ventured out into the wilds, and the directions they left are too unreadable to follow. Do you think they're safe? I understand your I understood you left the safety of your pod because it was damaged, but I expect better judgment from Risa. I trust that they can handle themselves, but this situation is uh, worrisome. We need to learn more about our environment in order to determine where they might have gone. Well, I can search for more survey probes. I already sent the data from the one you asked me to locate. Good, good, good. Uh, something definitely happened here. Uh, did you discover anything else? Well, Kiki and I made even more plants grow. We planted them next to each other and... Hmm, I have no interest in that assistant. I must focus on finding Risa. I'm sure Baha would be happy to hear your uh, anecdotes. Okay, let me see if I can chat with him then. Uh, I also see that I gotta go down at the bottom here to do something. Oh, there he is. Hey, Bahan, do you have some time for you? Always. Great. Look at this cool thing that I've learned. I just need a spot where I can put th uh, three different plants uh, together. How about this spot? I just finished going through the stuff and uh, it was lying around here. Oh, what are you going to use it for? And what about your back? Oh, it's feeling a lot better, so don't worry. As for the stuff, let's just say that it's for a, slight, a side project. But never mind that. Uh, show me what you learned. Okay, so in here, we got a tree right oh gosh okay so this one is a tree we know that next to the tree I'm gonna plant a herb and then I'm gonna dig this and I'm gonna plant a fern there we go whoa that is amazing right when the plants grow big like this it's even possible to harvest and with those seeds we should finally be able to uh, make some jelly. Sure, true. Yesterday was so intense, I didn't even notice that we skipped dinner. <laughs> uh, I noticed. My stomach was grumbly all morning. Uh, but I packed up some flavor capsules uh, super well so they are all fresh. I'll mix everything, everyone's favorites. Uh, I dug out the Exo Nutri assembly box from the uh, ship storage, but I'm kind of spent at the moment. Would you mind fetching it and, uh, and setting it up outside? Sure thing. Hold up a minute. Uh, let me get myself more seeds here. And I think I actually noticed that you can take out uh, some of these plants that are planting and replace them with something else, I guess, right? Uh, in order to make a, a perfect connection. So let's see if that is possible. So what I want to do, for example, here, we have kind of like a, a little farm. So that is also a tree. Okay, hold up. So we got a tree here. We got a fern. And we got a fern. This one is also a fern. So I'm actually going to remove this one. And instead I'm going to plant a herb. There we go. Connection much better now. Uh, here as well, right? We have herb, herb, tree. So I'm going to remove this one. And instead I'm going to plant a fern. Wait. Why... Why does he not like it? So we got fern, herb, tree. Fern, herb, herb. Hmm. Herb, fern, we got tree here. Hold up, let me remove that tree. 
So we got Fern, Herb, Tree. And then we got Fern, Herb, Tree, Fern, Herb, Tree. Oh, I think I just need a Herb. There we go. So every single one of the connections now is perfect. There we go. We can get more of these. Perfect. Awesome. I like it. Yep, this is all a perfect connection. Nice. All right, uh, Awoken Appetite. Fetch the Exo Nutri Box. Let's see if we can find it. I'm guessing it's gonna be inside the uh, base. Yep, there we go. And uh, let me place it outside, right over here. Oh, what the? What are those creatures? What? Put any seeds into the Exo Nutri in order to, ha uh, to have it craft a batch of jelly. Nice. Hold up. Uh, let me first of all scan these things. No. Didn't I tell you to uh, about that time? Uh, never mind. I forgot. Hold up, buddy. I want to scan this. A, per uh, a peculiar energetic critter. Hmm. There we go. We scan them. Next, let me place some seeds in here. Any seeds. One of each, I guess. Oh, he made the jellies. Awesome. There we go. Jelly time! Wait, did I just eat some jelly or what happened? Jelly's ready! Well, look at that. We might make a flavored chemist out of you. <laughs> uh, cakey tastes. Sorry, bud. This is all your food. Now, let us eat. I'm starving. Uh, this jelly is disgusting. There's no seasoning. And what happened to the flavors? <laughs> it tastes fine to me. If you're trying to protect my feelings, uh, no, they've already been hurt by this jelly. The flavoring fuse must have been damaged or something. No need to overact. Just fix it. I can't. This line was recalled from the market right before our expedition. Some accident involved a hamster. You are saying we do not have any spare parts? Uh, I'm sure Risa will uh, manage to make some more once uh, we're back, I guess. As much as I trust Risa's skills, I don't think they'll be able to. Exaco makes these things uh, function only with their own certified parts. Mm. Well, in the name of Plentiful, then we must eat the jelly as it is. Elder, with respect, I've had to mix some very uh, questionable flavors in my career, but this is unbearable. Oh, my pride as a flavor chemist, we must do better. Then what are we going to eat? Mm. I, I don't know. I need some time to clear my head. Oh, gosh. But unfortunately, that didn't really do much. Uh, so if I actually go into uh, inventory, oh, look at that. We do have some jelly that we can actually consume if we want to. Hmm. Okay. Anyway, let's chat with this guy. I'm so tired. I'm not surprised. You've been running around all day. Why don't you just take a break? Come, come. Let's light up a campfire. Oh, we gotta make a campfire here. Yeah, just like that. Hmm. I don't have my automatic lighter with me. There's barely any flame. Low oxygen level. Maybe the Elder knows how to uh, do this? Well, they were probably around where fire was discovered. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, let's uh, see if I can find them. Baha and I planned to hang out around the campfire, but I don't know how to start a fire. Hmm. Try finding something you have in common. That is always a good first step. Huh? Oh, I mean, the fire is not lighting up. Oh, uh, yeah, I can, of course, show you how to do it. Just give me some time to fight my foothold. Your what? <laughs> Wait for the elder by the fire. Okay, let me go do that. Now, let me show you how to start a proper fire. You just need to blow more oxygen into it. Good thing I brought my uh, tooth foot. What is that? What the heck is that thing? Oh, it's kind of like a flout. What the heck? Exceptional. Oh, my ears. Is that tooth foot necessary, Elder? Not at all, but it is certainly entertaining. I used to be in a tooth foot band back in the days, you know? <laughs> I see. Uh, what song did you just play? Oh, what did we not play? Uh, take me back to Ultra 1. I want to be an elder. Ultra love. <laughs> oh, that's my favorite. We mostly played covers exclusively with uh, Tooth Toots. I see. 
Uh, how did you learn to play? Well, my grandparents always had an appreciation for uh, Altarian folk songs. I picked up the uh, two flute from them. Uh, this one is actually a family heirloom. Do you still play? Uh, not much these days. Fascinating. What songs did you play? Oh, uh, what do you not play? Oh, you already said this, buddy. Um, how did you learn to play? What songs did you play? Let's go with Yawn. Is he a late assistant? Well, if you wish to retire for the night, then tends to wait to you. What about you, Elder? Well, will you go to sleep? Oh, uh, I have a bedroom in the uh, midship. See you in the morning and do not disturb me. <laughs> Alright, but I guess we can go to sleep to reset the day. Wait, never mind. I think we might have already done that. Oh, you know what? I think I know what I got to do. Um, I'm not sure what that is. Is that the energy I want there? Inventory. Uh, hold. How do I use it? Yeah, I don't know how to eat this. Anyway, let me chat with the elder. Assistant, I'm still feeling a little peckish. Uh, fetch me another plate of uh, jelly, will ya? Are you sure? It tastes really bad without the flavor. It is probably just an acquired taste. Uh, you younglings are so fussy. <laughs> then I'll bring you more jelly right away. Okay, hold up, hold up. Uh, give the elder the jelly. So go here, inventory, grab it, and give. Here you go, elder. Freshly made jelly. Ah, excellent. Hmm. So good. It is so savory. You must try it. <laughs> uh, I'll take it off your hands. Ah, uh, the aftertaste. I must relish this in private. Go now, you are disturbing my culinary experience. <laughs> I'll just throw this away in the uh, bushes. Wait, what? Head on over to the nearby bushes. Oh, maybe if I put it here, it's gonna act like fertilizer. Use jelly from your inventory to hold it, then bring it to the plants. Okay, hold up. I'm pretty sure it's gonna act like fertilizer, right? It is acting like fertilizer, look at that. Oh, these plants look really lush after I threw the jelly on them. White plants jelly, but Kiki not jelly. <laughs> Do you have taste buds, bud? <laughs> he doesn't have that. That's probably a good thing. You and the plants might be the only ones able to eat jelly. But I guess it's uh, still nutritious, even if it tastes bad. Look, the plants made extra flowers and leaves. I think we can take some without hurting them uh, now. Maybe show them to Bahantu. They seem to enjoy watching the plants uh, grow. If we're slow slightly. Jelly works as fertilizers. Using jelly on plants nourishes them and allows them to harvest other things besides just seeds. Ah, hold up a minute. So I can give this one fertilizer and this one. Harvest. Hey, it does give us a lot of stuff. Look at that. Fresh greens. Hey, there we go. That's pretty cool. The Bering Bog, I think it said, right? Uh, visit Bachen to learn uh, more resources, I guess. Hold up, let me also collect them from here as well. Because I might have some more. So if I go into the inventory, grab me more fertilizer. And let me fertilize this one, for example. As this is something I haven't collected previously. There we go. Bahan, look what I just picked up. Whoa, are these from plants? Those look uh, succulent and such a sweet aroma. Yeah, I think they absorb nutrients from the jelly. Hmm, you threw my jelly on the ground? You said it was inedible. Well, that doesn't mean you can disrespect my craft, my calling. Ugh, no sense crying over spilled jelly now, I suppose. Let me get another look on those plant parts. Hmm. hmm. When I was a student, we had culinary historical classes. Elder Yasmar, our teacher, mentioned this old way of cooking that uh, intrigued me. Back in Ultra One, they used to raw. They used some raw ingredients for cooking. Nothing processed. Can you believe it? You know, I think I can make something with these plants. I'm not sure how though. I can't use them on extra nutrients for this. Maybe Risa can build something for that once we find there. Uh, well, I wouldn't want to bother them, but uh, it'd be wonderful to have them here. Okay, so I guess I gotta go eventually to look for Risa. 
We have the location of another uh, surveyor probe. It seems to have land in the uh, estuary. The land gets all wet there, so not very good for ankles, as you can imagine. So you must venture out in uh, by state. Given what Risa describes in their notes, it could be very well uh, where they are headed. Regardless, it is the best lead we have right now. So go to the ship and upload the location to your compass. Oh, and if you find Risa, persuade them to return to a uh, herd ship, please, before Bahan tries to engineer any impromptu bedroom for themselves. <laughs> okay, hold up. There we go. Follow the single sound. All right, let's keep her going. Had to pause here for a second as I was getting a, a package. So nothing we gotta click here. I gotta keep on going this way. Let us see. I gotta clean up that stuff eventually. I don't know how. Uh, also that goo, we don't know how to get rid of it. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, the elder wasn't kidding. The ground is really soggy here. Yeah, hold up, we gotta scan something. Hmm. The soil feels so different. Maybe because all the moisture is just a hunch, but I don't think any plants can grow here. We might have to pay extra attention to what seeds we can try to uh, sow here. Hmm. Affirmative. Think time engaged. <laughs> different plants are adapted to different environments. Check the soil top in the area. You are planting and uh, pick seeds that can grow there. Okay. So, let me scan this first. So, this one is a mushroom. Wet and hard. Okay. Oh, this one going on wet. This one doesn't. So we got to plant one of these trees. And here I got to plant this one. There we go. All good. Awesome. And they're going to get rid of the pink stuff. Perfect. And at the same time, another thing we can do is go into my inventory. Inventory. And grab this. And there we go. Fertilize. 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 Awesome. They're going to have to make me more fertilizers here. Look at that. Collecting more stuff. Ooh, I did not want to remove that, unfortunately. Plant it back in. Awesome. Okay, okay, okay. Harvest tree. There we go. And harvest these ones as well. Marshy fields. Really enjoying the game so far, though. I kind of like the adventure style of it. Uh, something I wish we could improve here, uh, the lighting. It's a little bit too dark, in my opinion. I feel like uh, we should be able, or like the developer should be able to... Uh, Add a little bit more light into the world here because it's so, so dark at the moment. Uh, maybe even have, maybe like a character could have like a light on his head, kind of like uh, our, uh, kind of like how our bot does. So that would probably improve the look of it a little bit. Can I go through there? Up there! Hmm, yeah, there it is. Let's find a way around it. So I cannot climb up there, of course. Ooh, I cannot go through here either. Seriously? <laughs> 